Hi guys, welcome back. This is Demon Souls 2009 edition. I have been replaying this obviously because the remake is coming out and I thought I might share with you guys a little trick. Um, I don't know if this is going to work in the remake, but we can try it out. I actually think they might keep it in. Um, so we'll see. This is not so much cheating as it is kind of just time saving. Like I'm not doing anything that you can't just do normally by spending a couple of hours like farming. Um, but it does just sort of like save you quite a bit of time, especially if you're trying to get the platinum or if like me, you're just trying to discover all the like characters, uh, side quests and the lore and all stuff like that. So this is how to basically how to item dupe. So you can see here, I have just started the game. I'm just out of the tutorial and I somehow have 99 Crescent Moongrass. And you go over and chat to Thomas, you can fat roll over to Thomas and you can see that I've got 99 in there as well. Um, yeah. Like I say, it's not it's nothing that you can't do just by farming a bunch of souls and buying them. But if you do want to save a bit of time, here is how to get them. All you need is you can do this right at the start of the game. You just need the Nexial binding, which you get like when you first come to the Nexus. You don't even need to do the tutorial per se, but if you do do the tutorial, it will get you like, you know, a piece of grass. Um, you need to only have one in your inventory. So we have three half moon grass here. So I'm going to need to drop two. So I only have one. Uh, so we'll just drop it there. We can pick it up again later, but you, you probably won't need to because you'll have 200. You go over here and you speak to Baldwin. Uh, you go to buy item. You go to buy something that you can't afford, <laughs> uh, a fresh spice. Um, and you just walk away from him. You be really, really rude and you just walk away. Okay. And then when you do that, he is sort of like, he's pissed off as you do. You then press square to use your next soul binding for for all souls in return you then press start on the controller which sort of sets up the glitch go over to stockpile thomas chat to him deposit item deposit your one half moon grass and then quickly spam the circle button because it'll try and use your next seal binding <clears throat> And that is literally all that it is. If you go then oh, no. to take your half moon grass out, you can see there is 1,023. <laughs> so you can withdraw as much as you can carry and that leaves 99 in your bank. And that is literally yeah, it. Um, it's so, so easy. You can do it with grass. You can do it with upgrade stones. I don't have an up, oh, I do have an upgrade stone. Um, so yeah, I'll just do it for you again, just to show. I'm not sure if you can do it with arrows. Um, we can, we can test it with arrows, but yeah, it's literally so easy. So if I drop two of these, uh, go over here, chat to Baldwin, buy item, walk away, square, start. Talk to Thomas. Hello, deposit item. Deposit that hard stone. Spam the circle button. You have a heart of gold. Don't let them... And boom. We now have like hecking a thousand oh, or keep... rather 200 uh, shards of hard stone. I wouldn't recommend picking these up uh, because they're going to weigh you down. But you have them there just in case you need to level up you all your a... weapons. If you're wanting to try out a bunch of different weapons, hard stone will level up quite a few weapons to plus six. So there you go. That is how you item dupe in the original PlayStation 3 version of Demon's Souls. If you liked this, I'll probably be doing little guides for Demon's Souls rem uh, Remastered? Remake? Uh, which is coming out next month. Thank you. Don't forget to subscribe. If you like the video, then that means that I like you. Just look all around you. Cause we'll be standing true. We can always help each other. We can lean on one another. Keep trying. You can do it. Don't rage quit.